just got back from Pennsylvania. Um, I went out of state for work for a couple weeks. Um, and of course, that Monday that I left, it was like the 20th of September, something like that. Uh, the machine shop called me while I was driving. Uh, and they're like, hey, your motor's done. Um, so I paid over the phone and then I had my buddy uh, Mitchell pick it up for me. Um, and he's actually, he's been working with me. So he's in Kentucky right now. So I got to wait till he gets back to uh, go pick the motor up. And then I can finally begin uh, assembling the short block. Um, I know it's, I've been waiting way too long, it feels like. Um, but yeah, I was in York, Pennsylvania. And uh, last Sunday was Boxer Fest, believe it or not. Um, I didn't even realize it was, uh, that's where it was. or and I didn't really know anything about it, honestly. Um, it's pretty much just like Subi Fest. But it was, uh, I noticed a whole bunch of Subarus around where I was. And um, I followed them on Facebook, apparently. And yeah, it was Boxer Fest was like five minutes from my hotel but of course I had to work that day so I couldn't go but I got to watch and see uh, Subarus drive by and listen to them like all night when I was trying to sleep you know but uh, none of them were at my hotel or anything so I didn't really get to see anything up close but I thought it was still pretty cool but I don't know if you guys can hear that in the background uh, my power steering is whining really bad still um, I don't know if I mentioned that to you guys yet or not actually but uh after I installed that pump, it was good, and then it started whining, or the power steering kit, my bad, the Chase Bays one, I made a video on it a couple of videos ago, anyways, uh, so I kind of, I left a bad review on their website, and they actually got a hold of me, and they had great customer service, and they sent me a new feed hose, and an AN fitting that replaces where that hose clamp goes, because I guess that uh, hose is so big around, uh, you can't tighten up the, uh, well, you can tighten up the hose clamp, but it doesn't seal right around it uh, like it should. So this AN fitting is supposed to prevent all of that. And I'll show you guys that here in a second. And I'll probably also uh, throw some uh, photos up that Mitchell sent me of my block when he went and picked it up. Um, looks good. They didn't hot tank it like I asked them to. But they did degrease the whole thing and i don't think they charged me extra for that so it turned out great obviously i haven't seen it in person yet i'm sure it's going to be fine and it was a really really decent price i was surprised i expected it to be a lot more expensive but anyways uh, i don't really have a whole lot to go over in this video uh, i might install that chase base piece that they sent me actually but yeah like i said i mean i just got back last night um, I haven't had time. I worked two weeks straight, so I didn't have time to film anything while I was there, obviously. Um, I thought about, I actually, I did have one day off because we had to wait on uh, the semi to get there with some parts. But uh, I was going to film some stuff that day. Uh, I didn't really feel like it. You know, I just wanted to kind of chill at the hotel, uh, you know, enjoy the day off. But, yeah, I'm going to New York next week. So, uh, probably be another little bit till I make a video but uh I don't know should be worth it you know I'm I can't be can't complain I enjoy it so uh finally get some money to help fund uh fund this and maybe some future projects I've had some things in mind that I want to do whenever I finally finish this but if those will come to fruition uh who, who knows you know uh it'll probably be a while but yeah like I said I'll catch up with you guys here in a second. All right, guys. Well, here's a better look at that hose that Chase Bay sent me. It's pretty much just like the one that's on the car. It has this 45, well, yeah, probably 45 AN fitting on the end, on this end. And that goes to the reservoir. But the difference about this one is it has an AN fitting on this side. And they sent me this adapter right here. It's, pretty, it's really nice. It says WRX right there. Chase Bay's on the top, but this piece uh, goes right here where this plastic fitting is. 
Uh, this is a power steering pump I got from my buddy because I was going to just change out the power steering pump because I thought it was bad. But uh, I'm going to definitely try this first since they were nice enough to send this out to me. And from what I understood from their customer service, which was very, very good, by the way, I, I'd recommend any of these products to anybody. Um, they're going to start putting these with the power steering kits so you don't have to worry about this. But some of the tools that you'll need, uh, well, I got a carbon fiber alternator shroud, so I'm going to need this, uh, Allen key socket, a 10 mil socket, some Allen keys, uh, a ratchet, or in my case, an electric ratchet. You can use a regular ratchet if you want. And then I have an AN wrench right here. And then these jaws that go in the vise, just to make sure I don't scratch these up at all. And just to kind of go over on here, what I'm going to do, I'm going to start by taking this off. And then I will undo this hose clamp right here. And it holds the, this is the line that we'll be replacing. Um, I'll drain the fluid into that bucket down there. And then I will uh, probably pull this off, at least pull it up and out so I can get that fitting on easier. Uh, hopefully not have to re-bleed the system entirely, but who knows. guys well here it is all installed um i had some issues with this bolt because it's so tight up against here but i just got a quarter inch ratchet out with a 10 millimeter socket and got it hose seems a little bit long but i ran it up here it should be all right i already bled it and uh it's still whining a little bit so i might have to put a new that pump i got over there i might have to put it in anyway uh Anyways, I'm going to throw it back to you. All right, guys. Well, that probably does it for this video. Uh, I know, like, the last couple haven't been anything entertaining, really. Uh, hopefully, coming up here in the near future, I'll get some more entertaining stuff going on. Um, start on the motor. Um, stuff like that. But uh, just a little thing I want to throw out there. Um, I got these stickers made. If anybody wants to order one, or get just get a hold of me and... Uh, they're 10 bucks a piece. Um, I have the this style. I have some that says YouTube right below the logo right there. And then I just got some bigger ones. Um, they're not like huge. They're a little bit bigger than this. A little bit longer. Um, those will be here anytime this week. So I can't really show you guys that right now. But uh, yeah, if you want, if you want one, uh, my Instagram's in the bio. Uh, you can leave. Uh, your name in the comments or whatever and I can try to get a hold of you on Facebook or something like that um, but yeah 10 bucks a piece um, I only have a few left uh, I sold a few to my buddies so I actually got to get those to them too because I was gone so I didn't have a chance to meet up with anybody um, but yeah um, I got the power steering uh, new power steering hose in and that bracket AN fitting they gave me um, it's still whining a little bit. I don't think it's as bad, but it's still whining noticeably. I don't know if you guys can hear it or not. But, um, yeah, I'm probably just going to end up placing the pump whenever I have the motor out and stuff. I'm not going to mess with it right now because I don't want to bleed the whole system again and go through that whole mess. So, yeah, that, I think that will wrap it up for this video. I um, hope you guys have a good day. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, show your mom, show your buddy, you know. Uh, let's keep it rolling. Keep the subscribers coming in. Um, that last, my Superfest video has like 2.3 thousand views. Uh, that's just crazy to me. Uh, I never would have guessed I would get that much views on a video. Uh, now let's get the subscribers up to that and, uh, I'll be happy. But yeah, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.